Oh, we wish we had a full kitchen here, Patrick. Instead, we have a table Coming. and some bright sunshine behind us, but that's okay. It's summertime. We've got some great breakfast seats here, Chef Nazim. Yeah, we don't have a kitchen, so that's why I bring the fire into the kitchen. Right. Here in the studio. Yes. So we're going to do uh, banana oatmeal brulee. Like brulee? What brulee. does the brulee mean? It's French for we're going to yeah. burn stuff. Like you do, like you go to the creme restaurant, brulee. they give you creme brulee. What they do, they burn the sugar. Okay. And that get crystallized. That's what they call creme brulee. So we'll do, we'll do oatmeal brulee. Awesome. Banana oatmeal brulee. So now our producer, Tom, huge fan of oh, bananas. bananas. Yeah. And when I say huge fan, I mean he hates them. I think, I think so we should... he feels the same way about bananas as I feel about onions. I think we should bring him out here and taste this I know, he really taste, should. Uh, Let's this step forward a little bit so everybody can see what you're doing. Yeah. So it's just a regular oatmeal cooked up in, with the water, mm -hmm. boiling water, and then I add a touch of butter. I don't know. Should oh, not you? be. It's, it's like, should be a healthy option, but I love butter, so. But you mix it in. So it's very simple. Mm -hmm. Like any fruits you want, you can add some uh, golden raisin, you can add some uh, cranberry or any way you want it to flavor uh, sure. your uh, oatmeal. Then you just put it on a bowl. You know, I haven't finished my uh, oatmeal from the last segment yeah. yet. Probably this one it will do. You want to take like two packs of sugar and a sprinkle on top, open mm -hmm. it up, and I'll do So this same. is uh, regular sugar? If this is a turbinado, natural sugar is like raw, um, cane sugar. Okay. And we're just sprinkling on top. Yeah, on top. And this Cover is it up as to, much uh, as you want. Well, I don't know. That I'm going to burn it up. Okay. That, that's why we're going to do like... Right. Now, I've got a lot of hairspray on, so we want to keep me away from that flame. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> Here, <laughs> step back. <laughs> ready? I'm ready. Whoa, look fire. at that. So. I'll, I'll do the first one, then you do the second one. All right, that blue then flame is not go. showing up a great deal on TV. That's okay. Do your thing. So, when you burn your sugar, you let after get like nicely burned, and then you let it sit because you don't want to eat like hot caramel sugar in your mouth. Then you're gonna burn yourself. So just let it rest for like uh, 30, 40 seconds. Okay. That one is ready. I go to the second one. So then sugar gets settled down again on top. So it's become the crust. Yeah. And it actually has the smell of a, uh, like if you melt a, uh, right. a marshmallow. Right. And we're doing, we're doing real stuff here, you know? It's no yeah. faking. We live, you know, we're cooking, having fun. That's right. And then, and, and, and this, type of, this, uh, this type of torch, you can buy that from uh, Bed Bath. And or other right. places they are selling it these days. Oh, good. So I'll have you taste it. That's a little hot, by the way. A little hot on the bottom, but no, don't touch on the top. <laughs> Blow air to it, and, and then it'll, it'll, it'll cool off for you. Hey, right. Go. Should I take a yeah, take it chunk from off the, the top here, or from the bottom? From the bottom, so All right. the sugar crust will come to you. Yes. That's great. You know what? Everybody's looking, you were mentioning, everybody's looking for ways to jazz up their oatmeal. Right. This is a great way to do it. Right. I mean, you know, you have a uh, family of four or five, you know. Right. Uh, you're doing that in the morning. So everyone's so, wow, it's a little different. This is, so, yeah, I was going to say, this is like a million times better than instant oatmeal. Right. I think Tom should try this one. I mean. Tom know. would love it. He had. <laughs> Tom, what do you think? Right. He said no. Do you see that? <laughs> now, that's, that's a true testament. Tom just said in our ear that if anybody can make banana taste good, it is Chef Nazim. Oh, thank you. Patrick, why don't you give that a shot? I, I think I will. Taste it from the bottom. Oh, that's warm. This is good stuff, buddy. Was the other stuff good? Oh, it was. It's always good. Mmm. That's wonderful. Well, that's almost my mouth full. We love eating and talking at the same time. I know, on the show. we do that quite a bit around here. So good. All right, Chef Nazim, thank you so much. Thank you so Thanks, much. Chef. We're looking forward